I wanted to ask you guys, what do you guys think if I buy another hatch, either EG or EK again, and just make a strictly eBay build? That means eBay Turbo, eBay Seats, eBay Steering Wheel, eBay everything for the, you know, the budget people. We'll paint it ourselves as well, all of that shit. So yeah, it's gonna be like an eBay slash wish build type shit. It's just so we go fuck around and have fun. Split it three ways the car so everybody's gonna be pitching in to buy whatever part. So let me know if you wanna see your eBay slash wish build. No, let me know. Alright, so I'm heading uh to my boy's house. You guys were hitting me up like crazy telling me to uh do the install video of the BR, the rev limiter shit. Um so I'm gonna go to my boy's house right now. I'm heading over there right now. And we're gonna disconnect everything that we had on and basically do a fresh install. And we're gonna show you when I get there. All right, my boy. So we'll come with this, right? This and uh, come on, my guy. He's supposed to know this shit. We'll come with this and this. All right. So obviously this goes in there. Right there. Uh huh? Do we ever? Do we even touch that shit? No. Never. Okay. All right. So now you explain what goes to what. Okay. Right, you ready? Yes, sir. Today. The ready? yellow. Uh huh. You ready? The yellow. Let's start off with yellow since it's my favorite color. Uh huh. So this is for the igni ignition and throw up both of these right here. Uh -huh. You cut the ignition wire mm -hmm. on the harness to the ECU, BCM, whatever you want to call it. It could be for any ECU, right? As long as you yeah. know. Yeah. Okay. As long as you know your wiring. So one goes to the car, one goes to the ECU and one goes away. And so one to the connector and one going away from the connector. The yellow goes to the connector and then this one goes away from the connector. So I usually do is I cut it about two inches away from the connector to have enough slack. So you strip it both sides, you solder it, you connect this one to the away from the connector, you solder it. The same thing with this one to the connector, you solder it. And these right here is your 12 volt and your ground they're also located on the computer or you could go somewhere else but since this ties up to the computer might as well just look for the 12 volt and the ground there which is right next to it as well mm -hmm. a piece of shit hondas and this one right here is your switch that's supposed to go to the e-brake yeah this one's supposed to go to your e-brake or to any type of switch you want basically uh -huh. so this one what we're gonna do is since we don't want to drill no new holes for any switches or don't have access to any other switches because this car has a sunroof on it. Uh -huh. uh, we're gonna, and it doesn't have cruise control because the eliminator, we're gonna use the cruise control right. button. Uh -huh. But this reads negative, but the cruise control throws positive. So we have to make a relay to convert it from positive to negative. So this, because when he turns on the cruise control, it lights up, and this will turn on as well, knowing that, that when the cruise control is on, this will turn on as well. So you can show him that, right? Yes, sir. All right, so basically, if you know the wiring for your car, this should work on every car that left. Correct. All right. You want me to explain the relay shit over there real quick? Uh, you should explain uh, show the, wiring. The, yeah, the wiring, because this is specifically for a what? For this could work on mostly all B series for sure right now, right? Mostly any type of basically any Honda. From well, the, from any the, any car because I see people put it on a Toyota Camry. Eh? Yeah, you can just Google the wiring too. Oh, let me see. Right. So wait, go bring the freaking wire too, so we can explain it as good as possible. Just show us what wire goes to what, and that's it. And this has a step down harness, right? Yes, sir. You connect it to the step down harness or to, to the, the fucking factory? Okay, you heard it. Because uh, step down doesn't have any color wires, and it's hard to pin count. You heard him. So not from the step down, straight from the ECU. Yeah, so, pin one is your- What color is it? Yellow black is yellow. your 12 volt. Okay, so yellow black goes to? The red for power. Okay. So what I do is strip it back. 
the red from the BR, so it goes to the yellow and black, right? Correct. Okay. And I will strip it back. And if you're not confident enough doing it like doing it like this with the battery connected, you can always disconnect the battery so none of the wires are alive. If you're scared that you're gonna pop a fuse. Boom. Right. So you connected the red, the red one to the black and I mean the yeah the black and yellow. Yeah, and the one right next to it to that one. What color? And two is straight out black. Is your negative wire? So the black goes to the black. Okay, there you go. Is that the only black one that they have on that shirt? Or now there's a couple. There's a couple, but there's a second one right next to it. I'll get closer to it so that I can see later. So that's black to black. Yep. And then your ignition wire. What color is that? Is yellow and green. Uh-huh. Is that from the ECU? Yeah. And ECU. you're gonna connect it to what color on the BR? And the BR is going to the yellow. Like okay. I said, you gotta cut that one because of what the BR does, it interrupts, it cuts the fuel. So it's gonna interrupt it. It's okay, you know those little little fireballs. Mm, I like little, little shotguns, you know. know what I'm saying? Rice alert, you know. Yes sir, this is the rice mod. Yeah. So yellow to the to the connector side. So the yellow is from the BR? Yeah, from the BR is going to the yellow and green on the connector side. You say the yellow and green is cut. I'm gonna zoom into it later, I just because it. it's too uh it's too far away here, but they'll see what you're doing a little. This one right here is going for a switch, which I will show you after this is all connected. That's the cruise control switch, right? Yeah. So, obviously all your wires are over here, but you got to run a wire all the way to the other side. Mm -hmm. So, just for reference, I'm going to take a photo and I'm going to put it out key so they can see exactly how it's all wired up. That's the yellow and what? yellow black which is the power from the factory harness to the red wire on the BR and then your solid black goes to the black wire on the factory harness which is your ground mm -hmm. and then you go the yellow green from your factory harness you cut it about two inches away and then you divide it basically the yellow from the BR goes to the connector side and the green goes in the opposite side away from the connector. That's what interrupts the ignition. So you get that little two steps. And then the white one right here is for your switch, which we did a little different, set it to the e-brake. Because we want to do like, if you're driving, you could turn it on, just to, you know, play around with it. You just don't want to yank your e-brake and you know, yeah, cause an accident. So what we did is this has a negative trigger right here, but we connected to the cruise control, which is a positive trigger. But we made a relay to so convert it to negative, so it could work. We will show you that when we come back. All right. So now that there's a, this attached take off this shit over here. Uh. What the fuck did I take that shit off? What the fuck? This controls over here. What the fuck? So this car has cruise control because it was is a EK hatch and it was converted everything from a 99 coupe to 2000 to 2000 yeah so it was converted everything from an EK, even the sunroof has sunroof. Oh has everything. shit! Sunroof. Wait, can I see that? There you go. It has all the luxury, like it has the power windows. Power windows. 
from the sunroof, has the power so, locks. Power door. The power mirrors. It yeah, yes, even sir. has the little tweeters. It has wow. everything right over. So. Explain this mess. All right, so this, so I'll do a quick, let's show you how a relay works. There's a five pin relay. We're only gonna use the four pins. So how a relay works is basically, it works multiple ways. If you get this power and this negative, and you get this other side power, it turns on, it clicks, and then it'll give out the power through here. So if you're doing like LED light bars, you're doing other, other accessory parts that requires more voltage or less voltage, or you need to give it more signal, that's what you will do. Mm -hmm. But this, we're doing a little different. Like I said, this is positive. This turns on positive right here. This is your positive wire, this green one. And there's your signal wire as well to turn on the cruise control. And with this car has a cruise control option, but we took it off because we swapped it. You can see in the previous videos where we took it off because she's like, Yep. <laughs> so, what you do here is you put negative and negative here, and then the positive wire from, from the positive signal wire that you're grabbing from the cruise control goes here, and these two are negatives, and then this part will be negative as well. So, that's what you want. So, the top. And the left negative, the these, right positive. These, yeah, these two negatives. This is positive, uh -huh. and then it'll turn this negative right here, which that's what's going to the BR. That's right here. So if I plug this in, on the way. So, so right here, this is going to the BR. So these two, the blue. The red one is the BR, right? Yeah, right here. Okay. So the blue and the black. Uh -huh. These are both negatives. Mm -hmm. The white one, as you can see, is going to the positive wire right here. Like the light green with silver on it. To the cruise control, that's the positive, which is going on the opposite side. And then the yellow is going straight to the BR, which becomes negative. And the BR is red, remember that? So yeah. It's yellow to red. Yep, yellow to red, and the green is your positive, and your black is your negative. So like I said, you just, these two are negative, this is your positive, and it makes this negative right here. That's all it is right so there. So that's it, and that makes it work. Uh, and that's it. And that's it. So. And the previous video shows you using this, right? Yeah, it right, showed so them. All you gotta do is now, when you connect that shit, all you gotta do is when you click it, it's gonna light up that green. fucking piece of shit, and light up green, block at the end, that means the BR is activated. And that's it. Set the BR wherever the fuck you want it to be. I wouldn't put it down there where I have it. I'll put it like somewhere up there where you can see the numbers and shit. Oh, well, you gotta tell me where you want it. No, I'll, me personally, I don't give a fuck. I don't play with it that much. But uh, for people that are gonna uh, abuse it, I will put it like right where the cluster is at so you can see the actual numbers. Yeah, so you can play with the games or something like that. And that's uh, you it. can put it inside the, the glove. Um, yeah, what some people do, they usually, they usually put it, yeah. They usually put it right here or right here so they can see the fucking numbers and shit, but. I don't do none of that. I don't play with that shit like that. I don't no, it's like when you like when you're gonna be at the racetrack or something and you want to take off harder, this and that. You mess with the gains, so it yeah. could be a, a harder launch or a smaller launch. Or blow up your motor. Either Whatever way. you want, man. That's it. That's, see, that's easy. Done. I mean, I don't know nothing about that shit, but you know. Right. I'm gonna put everybody shit that was fucking comedy saying, "Yo, do the install video." I'm gonna put it right. I meet the whole bunch of shit. Just screenshot right there. Boom. Blah. Boo. Ploosh. Pa blah. Kadoosh. Right here, everywhere. You niggas got your fucking install video. VR off.